everyone. Today, I will guide you on how to create an advertisement for a product. With a product that you capture yourself and a background generated by AI. With this workflow, I have prepared nodes that can separate the background and nodes that can adjust the position of the object so you can customize it according to your preferences. For example, if you want to move this fruit water glass to the side for a better look, not floating like that, I will move it in the X and Y directions with the current object's origin at zero, aligned with the coordinate origin of the mirrored background. Here, the preset origin is positioned at the top left corner. The same applies to both the background and the object image. I will draw it out to help you visualize it more easily. So, to move the water glass to the right, I would have to increase the X, and to move it downward, I would increase the Y further. After being satisfied with the position, I will initiate this side to make it operational. I'll add a bit more about the background separation nodes. Here, I've used the background separation node set from SAM segment. You can search for and install them here. After installation, you may need to download some necessary models for it to work. Just click on the segment anything text, and you will be taken to the source page to follow the instructions there. After installation and restarting, please set it up as I have done because I have tested these nodes many times before publishing the current version. With the input size here, you can zoom in or out the object to your liking. These resize nodes allow you to adjust the size without distorting the original aspect ratio. Here is the size of the object after I have enhanced the details. After running, it will output the necessary for images for the product generation process. As for the depth of the object into the background environment, you will adjust the parameters here. The lower it is, the farther the background will appear, and the higher it is, the more the background will come forward. Because my VRAM is not powerful enough, I will divide it into two stages to reduce the load for the operation process, preventing the output from being compromised. I have set the colors the same so that you can easily distinguish where to place each part correctly. I will copy it directly here and paste it to save time. For this part, I will bypass them so they don't need to operate at this time. With the basic section set up for the generation process, I have also pre-configured them here including control net, IP adapter, prompt reader, sampling, and more. With the parameters I have preset, or you can change them according to your preferences. Now I will let it run to see the actual results. And here is the result. As you can see, the integration of the object into the background is quite good, with shadows and reflections. The glass containers as suggested in the initial images are also well represented here. However, I'm not entirely satisfied with this result. I will change the prompt to achieve a better outcome. The result is better now, and it's time for the output of each generation process. Everything depends heavily on the checkpoint you have. The reason I use the Stexel checkpoint is because of its good ability to handle prompts and image recognition from ControlNet. While the v1.5 versions are lighter, the color accuracy of the output is not as good. In addition, I have also done post-processing to maintain the image quality and details of the original object, especially keeping the text unchanged. This helps accurately promote the product without distortion. For the members on my Patreon, I will divide it into two workflows. One is basic for the basic package, and the advanced package can fine-tune the image position, depth, create masks for the subsequent generation process. With the basic package, you can still input two images, one for the product you captured and one for the background. However, in this package, there is no position adjustment, and sometimes the output may not be optimal. You may need to further develop it for your specific needs. For those of you who have equipped yourselves with a sufficiently powerful computer and a relatively strong RAM, you can directly connect the wires here with the same color to make everything run in one step without waiting. <laughs>